<laughs> you need it to recycle. And Why that's what's no happening. Get it cleaned. Well, I was asking a boy up there, and he says, oh, it's the council, they're no... I says, well, don't worry. That's what I'm doing. I'm getting on to them. I'll go down and report to them. Because and it really is. It's sad. Yeah. I mean, they've got... I know... Uh, they've got, they're short of cash. No, so no, they're they... not short of cash. Is I that know. what they're telling you? Then I'll listen to them, I mate. I know, because <laughs> they're Arab and Pitry. They taught enough they money for people. Fortune. In every street, and not just once. Kim, what it is, is they're doing the wrong things. Yeah. The money's going to the wrong places. places. It's like if you look in the roads of Dundee. I oh, know. You're like, what's happening? You're like, yeah. They never bothered about repairs when we were paying our taxes on the cars. Can like. They could surely get. You know, there's. I mean, I'm not. I don't know if it would be feasible. Is the people that are what to call it? Go to court and they're getting what would they call community, community service. service. Yeah, that's a good idea. That would be ah. ideal. Yeah, I would talk community uh, service. I would talk a group of them. Out. I'm 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 sort of like a conservationist and I, I yeah, love uh, wild. I, I, I agree with you. Ah. It's a great thing because I've been coming over here for years. I, I used to have a big dog, Kane Corso, and I used to take him across to the graveyard yeah. and hit the library. I put out for a lot of flowers in it, but I see there's only one lot left and that's at the first grave as you go in. Jim, uh, James Reed, his wife Anne and his daughter, uh, what was his daughter? Isabella. Uh, Good old uh, Scott's Al name, Isabella. Isabella and he's, I don't know if it's a brother or least he's right next to him, the family. Because I like going through graveyards. Yeah, ah, well, nice. so do I. Have you been to the up at Easy? No, I've not been. I'm curious, I've been. I've Inside, been. There's, a wee, there's a wee church, right? Just a, a, it's just like a hut. Uh -huh. But it's only uh, stonework that's left. Yeah. But if you go inside it, there's a big glass case. And there's a big, it looks like a gravestone, but it's no, it's a Pictish stone. Oh, it's right. got all the carvings on oh, it. Oh, yeah. EC Beth Orford. Right. It's just, it's a wee place, just look for E-A-S-S-I-E. -S oh, right. Right, and you go, you go there, and it's an amazing wee place. You get that sort of, I don't care if you, you get that solitude when you're in a grave. It's great, it's uh, great. Same with calmness, me. eh? And, and I'm, I'm not a Catholic, but I go to a lot of Catholic I'm not religious at all, but I love visiting churches it's and that. So do I. <laughs> I go to Spain a lot, and the one that I love is in Fengarola. And I go there maybe two or three times a day, every day I'm there. I've I been all over Britain, but I've never been out of Scotland. Oh, there's wild garlic here. See the white floors? Yeah. That's Ramson's. That's, uh, that's some beautiful... I'm going to what? I'm, that's what Have I'm just doing. Have you seen the Kingfisher? Yeah. I've not seen them this year. I've seen them up there. I've seen them doing beside uh, the Douglas Field. Uh-huh. Can, uh, -huh. uh where Iceland is. Yes. The Long Haw and that. That's right. The wee strip just beside the nine pitches, uh -huh. that wee strip there, that's where I've seen them. Uh -huh. And right. that was the only one time I'd seen them, and I was, uh -huh. I was oh, so yeah. blessed. I, kind of like, I was like, oh. I seen them up here, and he went in the water, so obviously oh, he, uh. he was fishing. Uh, I wonder if he has a permit to fish. <laughs> <laughs> the council would be, <laughs> they'd be right on that. <laughs> Are you talking easy, friend? Oh, oh careful. <laughs> careful. Oh. Yeah. Listen, it would be gorgeous cleaned up. Yeah. I don't, I don't mean it to be perfect. No, 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 no. You need that sort you of need roughness, it. can yeah. like, but yeah. you certainly need cleanliness. I mean, that's see it. like this. Any oh. kids, they'll trip right over that and tumble down. That's, it. that's dangerous. And oh. don't worry though, I'm on the case. Oh, good, good. You have a nice day. Right, thank you. No problem. Well, see if we can get the ducks now. But I will report this. I'll upload it to my YouTube channel. A Life with Brian, if you've got YouTube. <laughs> there should be minnows in here. I'm sure there's sticklebacks. Three-spined. Ah. Ah. <laughs> An our fine fellow. Marsh Marie Golds. And your Ramsons here. Plenty of Ramsons. Wild garlic.
Hello duckies. One, two, three, four, five mallard. Ah, where's all the females? There's a water rail over there. Youngin, I think. Just looks like a youngster. We got a picture of these guys. Now he's falling in a line, you notice. It's like, oh, if anybody gets caught, you the first thing gets caught. The water rail in the background there. We'll zoom into him. This is some mess though. I mean, look how dirty the water is. You can't even see the bottom here. I think that's yellow flag. Uh, pretty sure, which is an iris, a uh, native in. Native to Scotland. And it's pretty, let's see this here. This stuff here, this is meadow sweet. Philopendia almeria. Now this stuff is in the black houses and uh, ancient Scotland, uh, they would put this on the flare. The reason they were called black houses is they had no windows. And what they, what they would do is, to make it sweet smelling, they used Philopendia almeria. It's meadow sweet. When that grows up, it gets a race of white uh, flowers on it. It's like a bottle brush sort of thing. And it's amazing. No, that's stagnating. The fish are not going to be able to survive here. Uh, this is, this is, this is needing cleaned, right? We'll go in here and award the, uh, the council. Blue bells. There'll be blue bells. Or purple bells. And there's even a white bell. But no Brian bell. <laughs> And big crows around here. Nah, this needs to be done. This is ridiculous, man. <coughs> Such a beautiful couple of ponds. I think I'm getting that cough here. Narcissite. Now look, there's, there's a trickle coming out. A trickle. Well, folks, I don't think this is very nice for the environment. At all. Uh huh. This is like a flower and current, I think. Rigby sanguinium. See that it has that sort of ready, purpley flowers hang up. See, these really dendrons should be taken out and replanted with something else. Because they've not got any value. What they do is they poison the soil and it's an invasive species. It's no fear here, but it's indigenous now because it's been here and it's established itself for 25 years or more. Unlike the sycamore, which is the same thing, indigenous. This is like a beach is now opening up. All feathery leaves, really delicate leaves. Look, you can see my finger through it. And amazing. The things that are in this park are yours. This is a public park, like I say, the Caird brothers, the Duke Barnes, a while back in the 19th century, were so successful that they gave this land to the people of Dundee for making them successful. And this is your park, so come and enjoy it. Come and see it. Wait till it gets cleaned up and complain about it. Tell them, say, get that cleaned up, man, that's no right. Get this tidied up. Our youth of today need something for a future. And if there's no future for them, how should they care? And, I mean, it's not right. It's not right at all. And there's the Mains Castle, as they call it. But I'm not going to go down here just now. There's the wee burn down there. I'm going to go up here and see if I can speak to anybody about the state of the, the burn. Listen, my zipping a wah. But I think this is only the 
the uh, area for uh, machinery parts department. But then I'll certainly find out where to go. So I changed. We've got this big. Uh, there's the mains. The mains castle is now privately owned. Would you believe? Kind of reeks. It reeks around here. I sort of smell corruption, and I smell bribery, and that's what I smell. Fed up with our lands being sold. And like, remember 1314? <laughs> right, let's go and see if we can see anybody. Right. You know, there's a big water bowser. I wonder what he's got in there. Keir Park is certainly cheap. Oh, the carnival's here. It's not a good thing. Just see what we can see, huh? Padlock. There's anybody in. Hello. Speak to somebody. Morning. Can you speak to somebody? Are there any managers about? <laughs> Have they sent you? <laughs> uh, I'm looking for a manager or that. Officers just up there, mate. Thank you very much. Well, uh, Cheers, man. Oh, yeah. Right. right, thank you. Right. Cheers. Oh, wow. There's any of the uh, remote control machines. Cool. Any managers in? Any managers? Uh, well, yeah, I suppose, yeah. <laughs> right. Is he in then? Grant. <laughs> I can't speak to you, can I? I'm putting you on YouTube, mate. <laughs> 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 yeah. No, I can't about uh, the ponds. Ah, uh, hello. He got his number. <laughs> Is he here? How are you doing, Grant? How are you doing, mate? Fine, huh? Where's Eric? Is he out? He can't see us, he must not be here. Maybe he's seen us coming, Grant. He's hiding it. He must have seen you coming. Thanks, mate. Yeah, yeah. Uh, I can't speak to him, I can him. Oh, what is Eric? Right, Eric, could I talk to you about the ponds? Right, OK. Uh, they're half stagnate. Right. And I think they're getting constricted. If you, if you go for the wee bridge... Sorry, who are you, sorry? I'm a YouTuber. Right, OK. Independent person. Right, OK. And just a member of the public. Right, OK. And my viewers want to can, because they've been here with their kids and that, and their families and that. Uh -huh. And it's quite smelly. Right. They're telling me, for, I've come out of the way for yeah, up there, out right. of the way down. Yeah, okay. And there's a lot of stain, and that's creating blockage. Right? right. And it's diverting, the, the, as well as that, it's diverting the water to the sides and creating erosion. So, where is this before the ponds, or just, you know? Yeah, before the, the, the hill burn leading into the ponds, right, no. and then the ponds are, are actually the right. stagnating. Now, the point, right, if it's coming through the burn, actually belongs to the, the private company ID Verde, right? so I'm going to have to make some inquiries yeah. as to who's responsible. Uh, and Could I come back and see you? Of course you can, eh? That'd be uh, great. Uh, if you want to leave your details. No, I don't, leave my, de I don't leave my details. That's fine, that's fine. <laughs> uh, no, you, you're welcome to come back. Right, uh, excellent. Or I could give you my number and... That'd be good. Uh, give me your number and I'll, I'll phone you in a week or so. Uh, give, well, uh, please do that. Uh, a week to ten you. days. Right, so I'll just get a little bit of information for you. Right, so, so brilliant. Right, I'll go to Tober at phone. I'll go to Tober at phone. I'll go to Tober at phone.